saying unto him, Behold, we have forsaken all and followed thee. What shall mm -hmm. we have therefore? And Yahweh Shai said unto them, Verily I say unto you that ye which have followed me in the regeneration, when the Son of Man shall sit in the throne of his glory, ye shall also sit upon twelve thrones, judging the twelve tribes of Israel. Yep. Regeneration. Re means back and to generate. Your gene. Your gene. Your gene is your DNA, your flesh, your father, your lineage. Because like the the, 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 the children that are uh, under us, they're the generation after us. Right. You know? It's like it's like a different model of a. Uh, uh, of, 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 of say an iPhone. We're iPhone ones. <laughs> the generation is iPhone twos all the way up to, you yeah. know. But it's only three or four before it starts over, you know. <laughs> to say that one. Yeah, like like, like, uh, yeah, yeah. like, uh, like Tommy Tom son where you are when he calls the, the nigga one yeah, yeah, that's, that's the BT, the BT 1100, the BT 1000. He does it by the ages and shit. Yeah. Hey, he went as long as BT 850. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that got, Different old school ass ways, the older versions, and then the new school version, the little young girls okay. are doing the same wicked ways, but a new, a new way to it, a new twist to it, and a newer model of the same, same, same software, uh, yeah, hardware, yeah. same hardware, just a different update on the, on the yeah. software. Yeah. Exactly right. Yeah. This is Revelation chapter ten, verse eleven, and he said unto me, Thou must prophesy again. Before many people, wait, wait, wait. and who, who's that? Uh, uh, oh, it's a lot. Get, um, what was that at? Uh, Amos. No, 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 no. Uh, I want to say, no, no, no. I need, I need, I need two of them. I need the one in, um, I need uh, Deuteronomy four and like four or five, and then I need the one in um, Corinthians. Corinthians fourteen. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring out uh. uh is that one right there? Let me see. Bring out the Corinthians right quick. Yeah, yeah, we, matter of fact, bring this one up. Let me see, five, six, yeah, four. This Deuteronomy four and four. But ye that did cleave unto the Lord Yahweh, his uh, the elect, Go ahead. are alive, every one of you this day. Uh huh. Behold. That was the point on that one. Oh, God, <laughs> we're, we're alive, every one of us this day. Cause we still, we had to come back. Oh. That was written way back in the books of Moses. But we're back even into this time doing the same thing. I mean, you can get it. You can yeah. get the one. Yeah. Got it. And I also have another one too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But let me finish this Revelation. Yeah, you got it. You got it. This is Revelation chapter 10, verse 11. And he said unto me, Thou must prophesy again before many peoples and well, nations. The reason I wanted him to, 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 uh, to, to go to those other ones first, because the, the, uh, the one that's uh, Corinthians says, the spirit of the prophet is subject unto the prophets. If you're a prophet in any other lifetime, you're gonna be, you're gonna always be a prophet. He don't, he don't get it though. But, but he said you must prophesy again. Again. Yeah. Thou must prophesy again before many peoples and nations and tongues yes. and kings. You know, that's the reincarnation. This is a uh, First Corinthians chapter 14, verse 12. It says, and the spirits of the prophets are subject to the prophets. Uh -huh. That's when the same spirit. I don't, I don't see how the church could ever teach you this, man. <laughs> <laughs> can't teach you. Right. You can't teach you this. Yeah. So think about it. How many, but they read one or two scriptures. How many precepts we had today? I mean, it's just unknown. Yeah, 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 they, 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 yeah, he just read John the Revelator. The angel basically told John, you're going to prophesy again. Yep. Right. During this time, John the Revelator was... <laughs> A hundred, damn near a hundred years old. Yep. He was an old man. On an island. And he was on the island of, of Patmos. <laughs> yeah, yes. salt mine. You know? So there was never no record of him ever returning back amongst the people to, 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 to go Palestine. Back. Right. Yep. You know? Too old to physically do it anyway. Yeah. <laughs> you got yours? This is uh, Daniel chapter 12 yep. and, verse th and, and through the Spirit, you know, if, if you can receive it, you know, brothers mm -hmm. amongst us, we know who John the Revelator is, man. Yep. He, he, he came back and he, and he did promise like man. That's right. That's the reason why we know who the 12 tribes are. I don't see if he was going to tell you. 
Hey, hey, hey. Well, you'll, you'll find out later. Come. This is uh, Daniel chapter 12 and verse 12. It says, Blessed is he that waiteth and cometh to the thousand three hundred and five and thirty days. But go thou thy way till the end be. Yep. For thou shalt rest and stand in and thy rest. lot. It's like, it's like flesh is waiting for you to come down and take your place back as the type of uh, individual you were before. You stand in thy lot. It says, but go, go thou thy way to the end be, for thou shalt rest and stand in thy lot at the end of the days. Uh -huh. You know, we stand back in that same position again. And this time, this is the end of the days. You that one, right? You that one, right? Luke 9 and 27. But I tell you of a truth, there be some standing here which shall not taste the death till they see the kingdom of Yahweh. Hey, but, but, but that was uh, the Lord speaking then, right? Those men died. Yeah. You already got it. Yeah. Those, yeah. Men, <laughs> those men died. I love it. I love but guess it. what? They came yeah. back, and this one, they're not going to see them. You know, some some will as martyrs, but, but most think. Most of the prophets that got killed before, they're not going to taste death this time. Right, this death. Yeah, this, this time yeah, in this, this life. Death. Right, right. You got it, bro. This is Job chapter 14, verse 10. Mm -hmm. It says, But man dieth and wasteth away. Yea, man giveth up the ghost, and where is he? Mm -hmm. You know, and when you read this verse in Spanish, it says that a man's spirit is ripped from his flesh. All right, it's a little bit more detailed. Basically, that's the process how we read in Ecclesiastes that your spirit goes up to the, to the Father mm -hmm. to receive the judgment. It says, um, man giveth up the ghost, and where is he? All right, because the flesh gets buried, you know, but the spirit has to go up. As the, as the water faileth from the sea, and the, flood, and the flood decayeth and dryeth up, so man layeth down and raiseth not. Till the heavens be no more, they shall not awake nor be raised out of, his, of their sleep. Oh, that thou wouldest hide me in the grave, that thou wouldest keep me secret, until thy wrath be past, that thou wouldest appoint me a set time and remember me. If a man die, shall he live again? All the days of my appointed time will I wait till my change come. What's the change? That new flesh that the that spirit going back into. That's right. Hey, you uh, go from there to uh, what chapter you was in? 14. Go to Job 19. 19 to like uh, 25. And this one is obvious right here. Bro. This one is real, this oh, yeah, one yeah, is yeah, real yeah, obvious. Yeah. Job 19 and 25, that is a good one too. It says, for I know that my Redeemer liveth. Who's, who's, our, who's our Redeemer? Go ahead. For I know that my Redeemer liveth, and that he shall stand at the latter day upon the earth. At the last days, right? Go ahead. Th and he shall stand at the latter day upon the earth. Yep. It's like, it. and, and though after my skin, it's like, it. and though after my skin, worms destroy this body. What does that mean? When your body uh, decomposes, mm -hmm. decomposition that uh, takes place, when, uh, uh, when, when your body gets buried into the earth, it goes through that uh, ring of mortis, mm -hmm. and then it starts to um, decompose. decompose back into the elements. And yeah. the, the earth, the worm, the earth worm starts feeding on it, and all that. That's what Job is saying. This body right here is gonna go right back into the ground, and it's gonna decompose. It's gonna suffer uh, corruption. Go ahead. It says, "Yet in my flesh shall I see God." Yahabashim Yahushai. But yet in my flesh, flesh is decompose. How is it supposed to? Huh? <laughs> Come on, man. Right? Because it's a new flesh. <laughs> that change that uh, Job was talking about. He going to see him in his, in his change, his new body. Hold it. We're going to get that next. You know? He got first Corinthians next. Yep. Yeah. Kind of, kind of. Uh, I think that was it on there. Huh? That was it. Yeah. First Corinthians 15, sir. It's first Corinthians 15 and uh, 51. No, no, let's start up, sir. 40. Let's start up, sir. <laughs> this first Corinthians 15 and 44. And this, and this whole doctrine it, it is 
it links, it makes a lot of other scriptures yeah. more easy to be understood. Right. It's a lot of it's a lot of scriptures where you gotta understand reincarnation to understand that yeah. particular uh, yeah. scripture. You know? Yeah, like this topic, reincarnation, it totally cuts the hell doctrine. Because yeah. yeah. the hell doctrine is basically like you're gonna die and suffer eternal. Like they throw that out the window with this precepts and the linking of the lines that's how you break it down that's the process what happens to us and, and, and the beautiful i call it the death process right but the beautiful thing about it is that's good news so if i fuck up and i don't make it get this is what i thought before i came to the truth yeah. if i fuck up and i don't make it i just gotta live this terrible shit forever oh no, that's right yeah. but it's good news to know that that i get another chance to, to get it right you know that's right I, you got something right there yeah, yeah. So, Job 3 and 11. Oh, <laughs> Why died I not from the womb? Why did I not give up the ghost when I came out of the belly? Why did the knees prevent me? Or why the breast that I should suck? For now should I have lain still and been quiet. I Man, should. He would have been at rest. Yeah. Like, why did not uh, be, be a. Why was it? Why was not a stillborn? Why did yeah. I give up the spirit and, and go back? when I was born, you know? Yep, because that happens. A lot of women, or I don't know the ratio of it, right. women give birth to dead babies, man. Yeah. Yeah. You know? A lot of miscarriages and stuff like that. Happen. So it's like, the most size kind of like, he just sent your spirit. It's like, it's like a yo-yo. Like a he just... <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? No, 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 no. Yep. Yeah, you know? Just so you could experience dying. Yep. You know? Yep. I should have slept and then had hey, I been... Hey, because Job is complaining right now. Yeah. He's saying these things because of what Satan was doing. Yeah, he was jacked up. Huh? He, he, he wished he, he wish he died when he was uh, born. Yep. That's how, that's how, that's how yeah, that Satan was, was on, on Job's head, man. And the most I allowed him to do that. Most I was on, take yeah, he allowed him. That's why he, that was the cold part about that experiment. Of that. You, know, you know what I'm talking about, Job, right? The cold part about that experiment was you can do all, you can take everything from him. So yeah, but okay, well, took everything, it didn't mean nothing to him. Well, 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 I can jack his life up too, but you can't kill him. Yep. Joe was like, damn, why didn't you just kill me? You're sending me through all of this terrible. Come on, man, you can just kill me. What I do? Yep. Yep. He was a priest, you know? He, he, yeah, uh, he, was, he was righteous. Yeah. There's nothing like him in the earth. He sacrificed for the sins of his, uh, his, his children. sons. Yeah. Given offerings. Like, he, he was righteous, man. Hey, Job in Hebrew is Ayyawab. I just looked it up, and it means persecute. Persecute, uh, yeah. Persecuted. Persecuted, yeah. yeah. And, he's a, and he was a so-called Mexican. Yeah. From the tribe of Issachar. I should have slept then had I been at rest with kings and counselors of the earth which built desolate places for themselves or with princes that had gold who filled their houses with silver or as in hidden untimely birth I had not been as infants which never saw light. There the wicked ceased from troubling. There the, the wicked ceased from troubling. He's talking about the spiritual realm. Yep. Yep. The spiritual realm. Esau, demons, yeah, Esau ain't up there doing nothing to nobody. nobody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? <laughs> ain't no lies. It's all truth up there. Yep. No pain. Yep. Ain't like that, that, like that, um, that vision that the brother's uh, uh, wife had. Dallas. Oh yeah. That, that Edomite was on his yeah, deathbed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, she, and he, uh, she you know, she, she started talking to him, and uh -huh. he basically said, "Yeah, um, what, what God is, he, he's tricky, man." Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And he said, he said, um, he said, basically, we're uh, we're in, not important. We're in, insignificant. He said, we're insignificant. We're not yeah. important. Yeah. You know. So hey, the the, the nations when well, they spirits go up there. It's like they just put to the side, like uh, the Most High used them for, for their purpose, and then you got the the spirits of the saints, which which are the spirits of the Israelites. Man. God, that's right. that's They're on the right hand of the Most High. God, and it's backed by the scriptures too, because in uh, the second God, edges, the Most High calls them spittle. You know, America was destroyed. Yep. Time goes. No. This First Corinthians 15 and 40. There are also celestial bodies and bodies terrestrial, but the glory of the celestial is one, and the glory of the terrestrial is another. There is one glory of the sun. Why take Jacob? 
Yeah, he's just talking shit, bro. I'll take you to the call, the righteousness, the bills above. You know what I'm saying? Take yeah. all people to, to, to call the righteousness of the world, the wickedness of the world. Right. You're the only devil over here. You know? You're the only one that's doing wickedness over here. This is righteous. But, but like you read earlier, you know, uh, Jacob is more excellent than his neighbor. The righteous are more excellent than his neighbor. But the way the way the wicked seduce them. Yeah, bro, you got it. He's 41. He's just a demon. That's what I'm that's saying. Why, that's why he has on shades at night. Oh. <laughs> and then because he's cool. Yeah. You love darkness rather than light. There was one glory of the sun, and another glory of the moon, and another glory of the stars. For one star differeth from another star in glory. Right, can you read up again? Because with the, with the scripture this brother is reading, it means there's a difference between this terrestrial flesh and the celestial flesh, okay? Right. Now this scripture in particular, in particular too, I like to use it to cut the immaculate conception. Yep. Yeah. Because a lot of people say that the angel came down and popped Mary. That's totally out. Yeah, okay, up. bring it again yeah, up. I'm gonna start up here. It's a 39. All flesh is not the same flesh, mm -hmm. but there is one kind of flesh of men, another flesh of beasts, mm -hmm. another of fishes, another of birds. Yep. There are also celestial bodies and bodies terrestrial. Celestial bodies and bodies terrestrial, okay? Also, to the angels, got their bodies, celestial bodies. But the glory of the celestial is one. Yep. The and glory of the celestial is basically doing the bidding of the Lord. Okay. The angels receive the message from Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, shine, and execute judgment. Go ahead. Up. And the glory of the terrestrial is another. It's another. We procreate. We have sex. The angels can experience sex. You know, and it feels good. Go ahead. <laughs> there is one glory of the sun, and another glory of the moon and another glory of the stars, for one star differeth from another star in glory. Yeah, right, because the sun, so like, the, whole, so the sun has the most glory because it lights and gives life to the earth and it, it, it uh, heats up the earth. I think it, I forgot where it broke down, but it's in um, uh, 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 so, so, so right, uh, 43 or something like that, don't get it. But it, I think it was, it was something like that. It said it heats up the earth and it does grow because of the sun. The, the sun, that's what, you know, matter of fact, we should be. Yeah. Hey, but that but, but that's not the genesis. point of that we want to go to, though, right? Right, right? We're talking about the flesh. So my, 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 right. You know, I, I just get excited. Yeah, yeah, you're good, yeah, bro. bro. So also is the resurrection of the dead. Yeah. It is sown in corruption. It is raised in incorruption. Yeah. It is sown in... Reincarnation again. You need that now? You need that now? You need it now. You need it now. <laughs> Matthew chapter 22, verse 29. Yeah, I was trying to answer to say unto them, ye do err not knowing the scriptures. Of the power of your home. Right. For in the resurrection, they neither marry nor given in marriage. Mm -hmm. You gotta but, read up a little, right? Uh, I mean, I don't know, it's like a go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. But are as the angels of the most high in heaven. When you yeah, when you when you marry, yeah, yeah, when so, you marry, you, you don't you don't have you have sex and so like it because because uh, the, the wicked scribes and Pharisees, this is another right. failed attempt. Right. Yeah, they're they trying to trick Yahweh yeah. Shia. Yeah. And, and they basically came with that BS like, hey, uh, there's, what if you have this scenario where you have this woman and she married a man, but he ends up dying. And then she gets with a second guy and he ends up dying. And she gets with a third guy and all the way to the seventh guy. And then they asked her, so in the, in, in the uh, resurrection, which man uh, 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 do she belong to in the, in the resurrection? And the Lord told him, "You you do err not uh, 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 knowing the scriptures, neither the power of the uh, of the Lord." And then this is what he had to say: the angels they, they don't have they're not given in marriage. That's not even in their nature. There's the celestial nature. You don't have the same uh, uh, worries of the flesh. The celestial nature, man, <laughs> you you don't get tired, you don't get sleepy, stressed out. You don't have, uh, uh, you, you don't um, even though they can materialize and they and they can uh, they can eat, but really they don't get hungry or nothing like that. You know, they, they, they don't get tired. You know, they they they're 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 they're, they're based in spirits. Yeah. No. They could enter different dimensions from the spiritual world here exactly. and jump on somebody as a vessel and make them do something to manifest judgment. Exactly. You know? Uh, uh, us, we here walking in the flesh, we know that these bodies are weak. We can get sick, you know, we can get hurt, feel pain, feel pain 
you know? We can cut urges. ourselves accidentally. Yeah, urges. You know? You get horny. You know? Angels don't deal with that. That's right. Is that it on there? Is he? Yeah. It's 42. So also is the resurrection of the dead. It is sown in corruption. It is raised in incorruption. We're talking about the flesh, man. The chains of darkness. Go ahead. It is sown in dishonor. It is raised in glory. It is sown in weakness. It is raised in power. It is sown a natural body. It is raised a spiritual body. There is a natural body and there is a spiritual body. Yep. And so it was written, the first man, Adam, was made a living soul. Right, because Adam was the first man with understanding. Yep. Okay, there was a lot of uh, Adamites, but he was the first one to understand. When you read that in Genesis, go ahead. The last Adam was made a quickening spirit. The last Adam, which is Yahawashah, okay? You understand that if you can receive it, Adam was Yahawashah in the reincarnation, okay? Through reincarnation, the process. To one man called sin and to That's right. I think he's about to read it right now. Go ahead. Albeit that that was not first which is spiritual, but that which is natural, and afterward that which is spiritual. The first man is of the earth, earth. The second man is the Lord from heaven. That's right, man, because Yahweh came down, okay, because the Most High sent the Spirit uh, to uh, that flesh, Yahweh when John the Baptist uh, baptized him. Okay, this is my beloved son, hear ye him. Okay, he, he came in all spiritual, walking in the flesh. If there was a Richter scale of spirituality and, car and carnality, Yahweh Shai's uh, Richter scale will be all the way to spiritual. Okay? He well, died. No, he was in the flesh. No, he was in the flesh. Right. Yeah, that That's was the right. point. Yep. To, to, to further express that, that he can control the, the, the flesh. Yep. That's right. As is the earthy, such are they also that is earthy. Matter of fact, I go quickly. Yeah, yeah, it's right. uh, Hebrews chapter 2. Uh, let's see. 16. Is that where I want it? Yeah, 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 but I want to start up a little bit. Um, where did it go? Uh, verse 9. But we see Yahweh Shai, who was made a little lower than the angels, for the suffering of death, the angels can't die. They're not celestial, that, that they can't, the flesh can't be killed, because our spirits don't die, just the flesh uh, dies, right? Yep. It says, um, made a little lower than the angels, for the suffering of death, crowned with glory and honor, that he by the grace of the Most High should taste death for every every man. Uh, for it became him for whom are all things, and by him are all things. Yep. The first trust entrusted to, to the first man Adam, and then it'll be re-entrusted into him, to your house the last man Adam, right? That's that's the same. That's beautiful, because basically. It was through him when he was Adam that death came upon us, yeah, yeah, upon the yeah, sons. That's right. So through Yahweh Shai now, we live. Yeah. We become immortal. And that was what we were supposed to be prior to Adam uh, going off. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I so, won't jump the gun. Right. But, 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 I, but I'm going to say this. Nobody else asked this. I'm going to say this just to keep it in the back of your mind, right? But um, the, our final adversary, our Lord, helped us get over it. We're gonna get to that. Just keep that in your mind. Y'all know what I'm talking about, right? All right, let me let me let me wrap it up. Let me jump to 16 right now. Uh, no, 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 let me let me keep reading. For for it uh, yeah, for it became him for whom are all things, and by him are all things, and bringing many uh, sons into glory to make the captains of their salvation uh, perfect through suffering. Right, because when you read, I think it's in Psalms, the 8th chapter 2, the Most High had put everything under the feet of Yahweh Shai. Okay? Because Yah Yahweh, the Heavenly Father, He's the architect, and He gave Yahweh Shai the blueprint with the Alahayim to create everything. Everything you see. Exactly, the 8th verse. 8th verse. Oh, yeah, so like, I, I'll hit the 8th verse. So, Thou has put all things in subjection under His feet. For in Him that have put all in subjection under Him, he left nothing that is not put under him. Yep. But now we see not yet all things put under him. Then it goes into made a little Lord of the angels. I'm going to jump up to 16 now. It says, uh, For verily he took 
not on him the nature of angels, but he took on him the seed of Abraham. The seed of Abraham. Flesh. That means yep. through sex. Yep. Through, through, uh, if I'm not mistaken, seed in Greek is sperma. Okay. Which means what well, we release. You know? We bust an eye in the woman. You know? That's how he that's how he came. How was Shai actually uh, born physically, like how we were doing it. Like how it tells you in Wisdom of Solomon in the seventh yep, chapter. Yep. Okay, no, no other man. Yeah. You got it, bro. Come on. I'll get it real quick. Right, if you was done with your point. And they're saying he was made in the, he was made in the likeness of sinful flesh. Done, done, done. He's made under the law. That's 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 this these bodies. You know? And and, and really when, when I when this is always how I think about it when I when I said that scripture made under the law, I always think the laws of nature. Because who else was born like that? And plus, what 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 good would it be for for him to come with an angelic father and not the same way we came in? Of course, he could be special. He came that way, but he was here to prove that we born this way could be that it could be done this way. To give us hope. Yep, to give us hope that we can do it also. This is Wisdom of Solomon, chapter seven, verse one. I myself also am a mortal man, like to all. Man, this is spiritual because through the reincarnation, <laughs> the house of Solomon, that's right. King of King of Peace. That's right. And my and uh, uh, my church today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 King of Righteousness. Yeah. I myself also am a mortal man, like to all, and the offspring of him that hath first made the earth, Adam. and in and in my mother's womb was fashioned to, to be flesh in a time of ten months, being compacted in blood of the seed of man and the pleasure that came with sleep. Yep. And when I was born, I drew in the common air and fell upon the earth, which is of like nature. This is all birth, the way the nature has you know, the whole process of birth. And the first voice which I uttered was crying, as all others do. Yep. You know, we all cry, man. Yep. Yep. It says, I was nursed in swaddling clothes and that with cares, for there is no king that had any other beginning of birth. You the king of kings, Lord of lords, you know? That's right. Is that really more? Yeah, for yep. all men have one entrance yep. unto life and the like going out. Yep. You know? That's but, the point. So, so, and the like going out. But, <laughs> there's a but there, because when you go back into this, that question I asked you, what's our final adversary? And that ties into it. Go back to my episode. Uh, 48. And as is earthly, such are they also that are earthy. And as is the heavenly, such are they also that are heavenly. Uh -huh. And as we have borne the image of the earthy, we also shall bear the image of the heavenly. Now, 